What is going on everyone? My name is FC and my nipples are hard. Do not ask why they're hard. Because I'm about to, to tell you that's for you guys to figure it out. But, as you guys can tell, this is some Strand of the Agents uh, uh, Battleground gameplay right here. I'm on my Hunter right now. Um, in this video, I'm just really going to go over my new spec and my, and like my current rotation. Because from a previous video, like um, two months ago I think for a while, a lot of people have been saying switch up your gameplay, switch up your spec, a lot of that kind of stuff. So I did, I tried it out. Um, a couple of my guildies who, are, who have really, really good hunters in both PvP and PvE uh, decided they are going to help me out. So I went with it. And I'm just going to go over my spec right now. My PvP spec, because that's what I'm mainly focusing on is PvP, not PvE so much. PvP spec, I'm a marksman hunter. That's just the way I went with it. Uh, my tree actually is pretty much pretty generic. It's basically like um, a net, like what a net deck would be for like a card game or whatever. It's basically just what mainly has been used. Um, I have good for the throat, which is auto uh, my auto shot crits give my pet extra focus. I mean that's just something else to give. Um, just because rapid killing is in there, but I don't really all need that. I mean, I, yeah, I guess I could use that instead of go for the throat, but I don't usually, I don't know. I, I may go to that, I've been testing it, go for the throat, and I like it. I'm doing pretty good with it, actually. Pets never really been out of uh, energy at all lately, so that's good in that. Efficiency, that's just a basic. You need that. I have improved steady shot. That's, again, that's something you're going to be using if you're a marksman hunter. That extra, that uh, buff you get with the increased um, attack speed for that's something you're really going to want to use no matter what. Careful aim, that's just giving extra crit chance for people, for enemies above 80% health. That's not bad. That's definitely actually really good, especially if you start off with your uh, Cobra shot. Or if you have a proc up for aim shot, um, use your aim shot. Silence and shot, that's a basic for um, PvP. And then the rest of that row is completely filled out with uh, concussive barrage, which is successful chimera shots, have a and multi shots have a hundred percent chance to daze a target. So right there, they're gonna get extra days in case my uh, concussion shots down. Piercing shots, extra crit to aim steady chimera, and it's a th yeah, they uh, enemies bleed for thirty percent damage double for eight seconds. So that's another hot on them. So that's or hot a dot on them. That's really good. Sorry, I was playing on my uh, shaman earlier, so I'm singing hot. Um, true shot aura, basic, resistance is futile, uh, mark target tries to flee, next kill command, uh, is gonna be, um, no cost, so that's, that's not too bad. I need a new, I actually need a new pet, as you guys can tell, I'm using my, uh, cat. It's, it's a rare spawn cat, but it's not the best. I'd probably rather be using Humar, but I don't feel like level, leveling him up to 85. Um, just trying to see what else I have. And then just basically everything else is filled out. Readiness, that's a key. you need readiness, and then my Khmer shot at the bottom. That's my spec, and my all my other the rest of my points, I put two in a proof kill command because I just I like the fact that kill command can do now do an extra uh, ten percent with a crit possible. Um, Hunter vs Wild, fifteen percent stamina increase, and proof serpent sting. Those are just basics. Um, I have trap mastery. I do like it. Traps are uh, my ice traps are longer, and my uh, fire traps are just better. More snakes are summoned. It's just a for me. I like using traps a good amount sometimes, depending on what uh, BGM in. But I like doing that. And then my basic rotation is going to be serpent sting to start off with after a hunter's mark, chimera shot to a concussion shot. If they if they if they use mana to be a assassin shot right then and there, um, steady aim to like two steady aims before I can get that buff to a cobra shot, concussion shot again, and just basically repeating all that. And then when I need to, I'll lay my traps down. I'll use my uh, my scatter shot. I'll use master's call, disengage, whatever I need to do. Use rapid fire. Yes, it's a three minute cooldown, but with the spec I'm into, rapid fire does a hell of a job. You get so much good out of it that you should never not be using it when you're in a firefight. But that's really my, uh, my rotation though, just going through Serpent Sting, Concussion, Cobra, and then steady when I, uh, anything else is on cooldown. Aim shot if I have time, if I'm, not in, if I'm not being attacked, or if my proc is up. 
and then silencing shot when that's up on a uh, mana user. But really, that's all I gotta use. That everything else is just extra when I need it. Uh, like scatter shot traps, rapid fire. That's actually a an always. But everything else is an extra. So that's just the way I do it. I actually get around 4k DPS right now with my gear and my rotation. That's not awesome, but for only having five pieces of PvP gear on. That's not too bad. Actually, thinking in this video right now, I only have four on. I have my uh f my four tier or set pieces on, so that's not too bad. And the other thing I want to talk about in this video, yes, there was that, but I thought some PVP are. I definitely think more people should be playing PVP, especially just because my server is PVP. A lot of people don't PVP on my server. It's actually kind of annoying when I go around asking for duels or anything. And everyone's like, no. It's a PvP server, it's not a RVPP, or RPVP, or there's a role-playing server, it's a PvP server, and people don't like to do it. I hated doing it at first, but then I started doing it more, I started learning, I started how to, like, get what to do, when to do it, and now it's fun. It's, I, I like it more in PvE, because it's more of a challenge. Yeah, PvE gets hard after, like, when you get higher up in it, but, I mean, it's just learning. I mean, you can't really learn against a new opponent every single time, like in an arena or in a BG. You have to really quick adapt to it, which I, I like that more than memorizing. Um, the last thing I really want to talk about, though, is actually two two final things again. Um, right now, I'm doing a Dazzle giveaway. It's you don't have to be subscribed. You don't have to like, favor, anything like that. It's just I'm doing it when I hit a certain amount of subscribers. Uh, follows on Twitter and likes on my Facebook page. I'm just gonna put all the names of everyone in all those categories into a random generator and pick one person. And they're gonna get a dazzle. Um, I mean, I'm doing it at 200, at 200 subs, 100 Facebook likes, or 50 Facebook likes. My bad. And 200 fo and 100 followers on Twitter. I'm like over 60% for all that. I'm at 180 some uh, subscribers. Uh, just under 70 followers and like 27 likes on Facebook. So I mean, I'm really close to all that. So I mean, you guys don't have to, but if you guys could, just uh, links will be in the description. Just check those out, or even just leave me a comment. You don't have to like, follow, or favorite, or sub. Just leave me a comment. I'll be like, all right, th thanks guys, because that does mean a lot. It really does help me a lot. And before the end of this video, I only have like I'm just under two minutes. Um, some series ideas. I have so many ideas right now. It's hurting my brain. I'm so brain hurt right now. Like It's almost butt hurt. That's how potent this is. Um, I'm going to be doing a 1 to 85 mage playthrough with a goblin. Brand new to both. Never played a goblin. Never played a mage. I am brand new to both. I have no idea. Um, I think that'd be pretty fun. I'm not going to do every single time I log in, but I'll do like I'll do a uh, if I have, like a really easy quest line or uh, random that I'm in. It's really quick random. I'll do that. But it'll be live. I'll do some commentary for it and everything. I'm doing that. I'm. I actually think I'm gonna be doing a uh, Pokemon playthrough. That's right. Uh, probably Pokemon Yellow, Pokemon Emerald. Cause I haven't played those two in the longest time out of any of them. Pick one of those two games and just start off with uh, the Professor and work my way up to the Elite Four. Do that. Probably live stream that in some WoW. If you guys want to check my live stream, I put that in the description too. I'm gonna be doing all kinds of. I got Magic, Magic 2012. I'm doing that just because I just got a magic recently in real life as well, and I love it. So I'm gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be doing let's see, Killing Floor, Left for Dead, more Amnesia is coming up. So I'm not even haven't done that game yet. Penumbra Overture. Um, what else is there? All kinds of Counter Strike Source, some uh, Vigilant Arms, just a lot of more PC stuff. Not so much uh, Xbox. Maybe some Crisis too, or some Halo. It's about it though. But I only have a couple more seconds here, though, guys. But again. Um, just let me know what you guys want to see for series ideas for games for PC because I'll buy them just because I have the ability to right now. Uh, check out my stuff, like my stuff, whatever. Talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching.